everybody, welcome back to my channel, this is Rickety Games. I'm Sydney, and today we are back with a little demo called Locks. This actually was sent to me by the developers of this game. They are called Carol, and I'm very excited to play this game because it looks beautiful, it sounds beautiful. Um, it's inspired by the works of Tim Burton and Junji Ito. Um, it's got this very beautiful German expressionism type of artistic look to it. It's, I, I can't describe it well. It's like almost cardboard cutout or like paper cutout. It's so artsy and gorgeous. You guys are about to see it. It's really, um, honestly, artfully mind blowing. And it's got an original score to it. Very excited to dive right into this. Um, and I'm also very thankful that to be sent a game. It was very exciting. This was the first one that was ever sent to me. So thank you, Carol, for um, sending your demo to me. And I'm very excited to play it. Um, like I said, you guys should absolutely try this game for yourselves. And uh, let's get right into it. I love the score so far. So we play as this little puppet. Ooh, we've almost got that like Bernard Herrmann score in there at the very end with like the psycho, it was like high strings in there. Oh wow, this is so cool. Whoa. Oh my goodness. The whole world is going. <gasps> oh! Whoa! How elaborate. Look at me go! I'm going! Oh. And I gotta turn the world upside down to get it? No? Oh. Oh, there we go. Okay, eat a grab. And do I use it here? No. Look at me jump! Woo! Oh, I went smaller. Okay. There we go. So it looks like you're gonna have like environmental type puzzles as well. Ooh. What? Give me the key. That was rude. What if I leave? Oh, they're teasing me with the key. Rude. Get a little gargoyle buddy there. Hmm. What do I do? It looks so cool, but do you see what I mean? Like it's got that like paper cutout kind of thing. But like when he turns around, he's like still kind of 3D. Ooh, that's so cool looking. I have no idea how to grab this key. Oh, okay. So that turns. Oh, I got it. I think I just grabbed it. This is going to be really fast. Yeah, baby. Ooh, this is so cool. Oh my goodness. <laughs> You see that in the background? That was creepy. What? Oh. Oh. Oh, I gotta like take myself up. How do I? Maybe a quick. Oh, there we go. You get it? Little moon key? Yeah, I do. Can I turn off the... Oh! They like chime. That's cool. Also, I love the little... I don't know what it is. The little clicky noise when I walk. It's very crafty. It feels like a mechanical... Did the house say 666? Or 996? Ooh. I love puzzles. What does it say? Two o'clock? Can we keep going? So two o'clock. 
And ooh. Oh, I see you. Can I take this? No. Oh, but it like comes with me. Can I build up momentum? Oh, the windows are cool. They look like feet. So I'm stuck. So I gotta figure out something with oh the key mimics me. Hmm. Let's see. I go this way. It's like close, but no. So it's like one side or the other, but I guess my question would be like, why do we want one side or the other? Hmm. Does it change something over here? Ooh, is the clock fucked up? <gasps> Oh! Did it change? Oh, well, now I have to jump like, through the top of the door. Oh my god. Oh, hell yeah. Aha. Uh -huh. Gotcha. That's why we want to change it. I got you. So this is cool. So, like, this is what I was kind of about to say before I got enveloped in the puzzle. Oh. That was creepy. Um, is that like this so not just being a puzzle platformer um, it uses oh my god I keep trying to go through the same uh, it uses the environment itself like you have to like flip the world upside down and stuff which is really cool got it got the key Ooh. I did not notice that little lever on the clock there. It was just like, ooh, funky hands. Ooh, going on. Oh, it's so cute. Ah. Oh, that's cool. Like, we can suddenly climb it. Close. Right? We can suddenly climb it. Oh, even better. Little rope. I love my pants. I just jump down. Oh, I gotta bring it deck down. There we go. Now we can unlock it. Hell yeah. We we're figuring it out. Whoa. This is a room. <gasps> uh oh. This is a chair. <laughs> What is it? The floor is lava? Don't touch the ground! Uh oh. Okay. So is the idea not to touch... Oh. What the heck? Oh. Isn't that a lever, though? No? Oh, I get it. I kind of get it. I have to, like, climb back up. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay. I got you, I got you. Okay. And then if I... Ooh, but I fell again. Okay. So I can stand on the boxes. I gotta, yep, nope, not that. Ooh, taking all my dexterity in my fingers. <laughs> no. Up. And then. No. I wanna like press the action button and also the jump button. Okay. Oh, okay. Just jump. Oh, it's the sides. Toast. Oh, we almost made it. Yeah, I think we made it. Hell yeah. Red button. Uh oh. 
Ooh. Oh, toast. So they chant little, little roses that come down to give me. You did well, but not well enough. All right. I thought I could jump it. So it's like two and then one and then one up. Oh, I'm so close. I panicked. It's very cute. It's very quiet. That ominous. Like, what is it, like, low E or something? It's such a chord, like, it just, it means danger. Oh, I keep panicking there. Up. Up. Mm-hmm, and this is the double. And then, don't move. There we go. Oh, woo. We made it? We made it? Yeah! I was like, oh. Because, like, I keep thinking, oh, hole in the floor. Oh, no. Those nights. Yeah, I don't have Ashley to help me. Hello, good night. Good night, good night. Oh, we can turn it around. Oh, and the light's off. Huh. Okay. So what does the light have to do with it? Yeep. Those those uh those little hammers are I almost don't see them. Hmm. So I'm guessing we probably need to flip the world upside down. So what happens? Ooh. I get a little flashlight. Get some mouse. Oh. 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 What? I moved this thing. I moved the spear thing. So now what happens? Ooh. No. Oh. Do I gotta- I gotta do this now? No? Ah! So I move the spear thing. And then turn the lights back on. And then... Flip it? Ooh, yeah. Oh! Goodbye! Do I have to fall back through the hole? Ooh. Trippy. Oh, the other way. Okay. It's gonna tell me to go back. <laughs> Ooh. You got repeating rooms. I'm trying to think of... The little head shape kind of reminds me of Five Nights at Freddy's. It's got that, like, pixelated blockiness to it. Ooh. Oh, we're going down to Mountain Town. Uh oh. <laughs> we're just gonna fall forever. Like I did the the portal thing. Whoops. Oh, is it an elusive door? It appears to be. I've done the bad thing again. Here we go. We're leaving. Oh, one day I'll find the switch again. So now it says the other way. So what if I go the other way? 
It was oh. Stuck? Stuck. Oh no, they've trapped me. Uh-oh. That wasn't very kind. What if I don't listen to the arrow and I keep going this way? Does it matter? Hmm, okay. Seems to uh oh. Uh oh. I'm still going. Oh. Whoa. Where are we? Oh, okay. So, like, you can stand on the black? Ooh, I'm digging the music. Oh! So they all turn. Oh, that's cool. How clever. Okay, so the gr like the the dirty ones, like these like off white ones, they don't turn. But the white ones, they turn. Ooh. Oh, there's the key. How serendipitous. Four almost got murdered. <laughs> okay. Okay, now we gotta go back up somewhere. stuck. I think I trapped myself. I think I trapped myself. Oh my god, I put myself in the exact same spot. Oh no, I'm trying to get the key. gonna get stuck all right there we go <laughs> okay we're back in business so I think I'm like a little bit over eager when I move if you move with the thing it kind of throws you a little bit it's like if you just wait then it kind of works out better for you Now we need to find where the door is. I'm guessing it's a little bit more over. Ooh, maybe I need to turn this one in order to get up to this one. No, this one doesn't move either. I, like, I have no idea which direction I'm to go in. I'm assuming it's up this way? I mean, I'm, I kind of just dumb luck wandering trying to figure out where to go. We have a little bit more agency up here. We did get the key. Looking for the door. Oh, there's the door. Okay, it took a minute to find the door. 
once you found it, it wasn't so bad. Is that a cockroach? In the tub? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hello, buddy. Whoa. So I became bigger? Or smaller? Whoa there. Oh my god, there's like a... Do you see the puppet in the back? There's like the face. Ooh. I think I made it. Yeah. It's getting creepy. Uh-oh. I can't move. <gasps> Hello. Uh-oh. So I gotta run? Uh-oh. Oh. Just go down the toilet? Oh, at the end! With the eye. Ooh. Okay, well, that was cool. I got a little lost there in the checkers area, but other than that, it was really cool. Very inventive. Um, I love the different puzzles. They're definitely not too hard to figure out. Um, I feel like the little levers on the walls could be a little bit more noticeable. I definitely didn't see them for a while. I think they're like nails, which is actually really cool. Um, they're definitely like a part of the setting. Like it looks like a part of the world. And I was just like, oh, there it is. It's like a decoration, but it's not. Um, but that's probably part of the charm. Trying to figure out kind of like what is set dressing or what is stuff that you can mess with. Um, I love the puppet aesthetic. I mean, I love the, the art aesthetic in general. It's very... Like I said, German expressionism with long, elongated shapes, um, kind of harsh, you know, contrast and colors and stuff. But it's also got this kind of very like, I don't know, like cartoon is not the word, but like spooky, um, almost old timey in a way. Definitely very Tim Burton. Um, it's got definitely got like very fun kind of whimsical vibes to it. I loved the music that we did get to hear. Uh, it was very cool. I would definitely play like a full game of this. It seems very inventive. It seems very like, very interesting. I'd love to know more about the story and the little character that we play. We're obviously a puppet and we're stuck in this like puppet world and we're trying to like find our way out. But it looks like there's like a bigger puppet or like a master puppet that is watching us for sure. But I wonder if it's like also like trying to own us or like, be, or it's like captured us in a way of some kind. Um, definitely hooked carol you guys did a great job you guys should definitely find this in the steam store um save it to your wish list for when it comes out there's no current date for when it comes out yet it just says coming soon but as you can see they're putting a lot of heart and soul and effort into such a beautiful little game and i'm excited for when it does come out i'll put the link in the description below and maybe i'll do like a little informational card or something i don't know what i can do but I'll put things where you can find them. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.